and thanks for watching another video by Sebastian Ektal Photography. In this video I will be talking about how you can recompose your subject in your photo, the subject you want to photograph, how you can recompose it to another uh, place in your photo. Like say if you lock your photo, lock your subject Lock the focus on the subject on one of the focus points and if you want to uh, let's say not have the subject on the focus point you want to have it somewhere else on the, the frame or inside the frame how you can change that uh, subject without uh, needing to uh, recompose the shot I mean how you can do that without uh, lock a new focus so the camera need to focus again and the basics of how, how to do this is uh, to lock the camera to lock the focus on a subject you push down the shutter halfway down and in most cases you hear a beeping sound and that means that the camera has locked the focus uh, it ha it's ready to take the shot, all the settings is locked in the camera and but if you say most cameras have three focus points maybe so, uh, and some pocket cameras only have one focus point some cameras have 11 focus points it, even I think the expensive cameras have like 52 focus points but you might maybe don't want to put the focus, put the, your subject in one of those points. So how do you get focus on the subject uh, if you want the subject in another place of your photo, which there aren't maybe not any focus points. And to do this uh, is because when you lock the focus on a subject. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate on uh, an, an uh, item you will see in the video above me uh, which you, where you can see that I have locked the focus on one of the uh, focus points uh, the left focus points the, f uh, the left from the middle focus point and now I've locked the focus so uh, the focus is locked between the distance from my camera body to the subject I want to photograph so if I now when I have locked the focus uh, sh push down the shutter halfway if I now move my camera let's say let's see if we move the, the camera closer to the subject you will see what happened that the subject you want to photograph will get out of focus because your focus was red in the distance you had before even now when I make this video if I go towards my camera I will get out of focus if I move back you can see on the video if I move if I move back from my locked in focus that the subject will also get out of focus but how can I then uh, recompose my subject if I don't want it to be on the left uh, focus point which I show, chose I want, to, I want to have it on one of the four uh, rule of thirds if you have heard about rule of thirds you know that there are four perfect spots to put a subject if I want the subject in one of those points but there is no focal, uh, focal point there which I can't lock the focus in. So what I do is I lock my focus on the subject in one of the focal points but I now, I now know that I can't move the camera forward or backwards but what you can do is you can as long as the distance is the same you can when you have locked in the focus uh, on the shutter you can move it to the left and to the right because that's the same distance so when you lock the focus you move the camera a bit, a bit to the left it's the same 
there is the same distance between you, your camera body and the subject, but you will have moved the subject in the frame. So that's how you do it. If you uh, don't understand what, what, I'm, what I mean or what I'm talking about, leave a comment below. Please, if you like my videos, please subscribe to me. Uh, I, if you have any questions, this video is actually a response to a mail I got from a, uh, a beginner photographer uh, that needed some help. So, and I answered her like two days after I got the question, I answered her by mail and uh, I also thought that it should be um, good for other uh, photographers that need some guides, need some help. Just like I do, when I need some help, I uh, read and I look a lot at videos on internet. So thanks for that and be sure to check out upcoming videos. Uh, what else is there to say? I'm very thankful for all the questions. I've been getting a lot more questions lately. Remember, have fun photographing. Peace.